Greetings everyone, in this video we will be discussing how to activate MacFA product key. So let's just dive into the video. All you need to do is simply head over to their official site and you can see they have step by step process how to get your um, product key redeemed. So you are going to be clicking on MacFA.com slash activation. This is the link that we are going to be heading on. Let me click on that. Once I click on this, you will be able to see that now we will be directed towards another section and here you need to enter your 25 digit based product key. Now how you can get the product key is of course by paying them for activation and subscription. Once you do, they will email you the product key that you can enter in here and then you will already enter the email for your account that you are using and once you do that your Mac FA will be easily subscribed so that is a quite simple method I hope you like it make sure to subscribe to our channel thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video hi everyone and welcome back to another video in this one we will be discussing about how to extend or cancel mac fa antivirus subscription so without any further ado let's just dive into the video the very first thing that you need to do is simply head over to your account from the top of your screen on the top right side you can see my account option click on that now just wait for a couple of seconds until it loads up you will be able to see your subscriptions in here so as you can see some options have been opened up just scroll a little bit down and you can see your subscriptions in here so your account is basically the place from where you can easily extend or uh, cancel subscriptions so you can see the subscriptions uh, tab in here click on that And once you click on that, you will be able to ask to sign into your account. I'm going to be quickly entering my details in here. And once I do click on sign in. And it is basically heading over to the subscriptions. So here will be populated your current subscriptions and all that type of stuff you can easily remove a subscription or even extend it by purchasing so this is quite simple process to extend or cancel your subscription on mac fa antivirus i hope this helps guys make sure to subscribe to our channel thank you so much for watching and see you guys in the next video Hi everyone and welcome back to another video in this one we will be discussing how to stop mac fa blocking my downloads so what you need to do is simply remove the extension that you are using on their um, browser service that they provide so head over to their official mac fa web advisor extension section and then click on this remove option and it will be asking you for uh, confirmation click on remove and now whatever you are going to be downloading from the browser it is not going to be questioning it because it sometimes detects some corrupted files viruses threats so it is trying to protect and prevent that so once you remove the extension it will no longer be blocking any type of downloads so quite simple and easy method no rocket science in here and yeah i hope you learned something new if you found this video helpful please leave a like and subscribe to our channel thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video hi everyone and welcome back to another video today we are going to be discussing how to stop mac fa pop-up so all you need to do is from your mac fa software you need to simply head over to this lock option on the top left side of your screen as you can see currently i'm using mac fa on browser and you need to simply click on this option then you need to head over to permissions for this site so head over to that from here you have this option of notifications and this is by default on ask you can either allow it or block it so you are going to be simply blocking it and what this will be doing is it will be disabling any type of pop-ups that are randomly showing up by mac fa it is just trying to um, inform you about different type of information errors or potential threats so that is no more going to be happening so this is the quite simple method to do it i hope this helps guys make sure to let us know in the comments below what else you want to see on the channel thank you so much for watching make sure to subscribe and see you in the next video